All right, today's stream's a little bit different. I was planning on playing Dark Souls, but my audio is completely scuffed. I actually tried even streaming Dark Souls yesterday. I don't know what it is. Could be because I'm using an Xbox controller and I haven't streamed using one before. But my audio was super scuffed with my mic slot being in the Xbox. I'm not fully sure why. It could just be my controller itself. Uh, but today we'll be playing this game called Tower of Fantasy. Now I've heard of this game before. I heard it was compared to Genshin Impact. And I've played Genshin Impact before. I wasn't a really big fan of it. But, I don't know, they added this game to PlayStation 5 as well as PS4. And I wanted to give it a shot. This game actually has decent combat. Yeah, the jetpack's actually kind of cool. I like this feature. What's this thing? Okay, I guess it just... It just goes. I have no idea. That's a cool looking rabbit. It's just got big ass ears. Does it drop anything? Gamey and reared something. I didn't fully read that. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's surprisingly cool. What the hell is this? Uh, I'm not going to worry about that right now. Oh. All enemies have a weakness. Oh, that's kind of like uh, the thing in uh, Genshin Impact. Okay. Oh, uh, it just does it? Why would I not hit perfect decipher then? I'm assuming that's like a early level sort of thing. Like the higher the value, the harder it gets. So that was like a level one beginner tutorial sort of thing. So I probably didn't have any difficulty doing it. What? Okay. Did that do anything? Is there more of them? Like something up here maybe? I don't know. Is that like another player? Is this game like an MMO? Kiro Sina. Common herb rooted in underground petroleum veins. It is said that good stuff hides beneath the oil stored in the plant. So do I beat it up? No, I don't just beat it up. Maybe it's like an elemental attack that I can't do. Yeah, it doesn't seem like I can do this. Let's go beat up this guy. Knock him off the mountain. Yeah! Does he die from that? That's sick. That's enough little early game exploring. Let's go actually try this, whatever this mission is. Here we are, the Omnium Tower. Is the droid up on the Omnium Tower? Well, when I came here with Uncle Paulu, we took the elevator and I almost fell off. I like how this game is voice acting. <laughs> I love how you carry these things. I don't think I'm supposed to bring this. Wait, this game has bears? Alright. Oh, it's got, it's got bears and boars. I just saw that. Nah, this actually might be kind of a good game. Can I go, can I go fight a wild bear? My brother will definitely see us in a different light if we can solve the problem by ourselves. And if we can't solve it, we'll bring the intel back and let my brother deal with it with his people. Nah, we got this. I've played video games before. Issues 
I don't want to get hay for saying something like this, but I kind of think this game is way better than Genshin Impact. It's a cool looking enemy. This game has a good combat system. Insufficient ships to unlock, so then a force decipher, I would assume. It's activating self destruct. Do I run away while it's doing that? No? Okay. I don't really get the point of that. Is he talking in Japanese? Right now it's talking in English. Tall tower over there? That's the tower of fantasy. They said the thing. Um, a group of really powerful and mysterious people. <laughs> what was the budget for this game? It definitely seems solid. For being some like weeb anime game, I'm actually kind of impressed by this. Crazy enough, I've been kind of enjoying it. Here's the gacha system. Yeah, what are they showing? So did I get the person, or did I get the halberd? Okay, so it's some, like, chick's halberd that I'm using. That's kind of cool. Oh, it's just some, like, up attack, so... Oh, it's probably, like, I can launch the enemies in the air and follow up with, like, an air combo. Yeah, that's probably exactly what it is. Or it could probably also be used as like an extra double jump, so that's kind of cool. Oh, AI algorithms. Okay. That's kind of cool, actually. So you can take the uh, combat memory from other people that have existed in history. So I think I just about finished the tutorial of this game. Echo. So I got her combat memory for the spear. Okay. Are we starting a new journey? Activate some, yeah, sure. Wait, whoa. Wait, now I'm an anime chick. Oh, so I can just become them? I wonder if you also take their voices. If you take their voices, like the voice acting, then maybe that'd be kind of cool. Yeah, that's pretty much just about it though. I'm gonna go ahead and check out some of these uh, characters that are in this game, see if I like any of them specifically. Okay, I already, I kinda like this guy already. He's got some villain energy to him. What? What the fuck? This guy's kind of cool. She fights with like a shield or something. That's that's interesting, actually. That's a lot of blades. That's five of them. That's kind of cool, actually. His name is Crow. Is it possible to try people out before you actually get them? It doesn't seem like it. All right, well, this game's actually kind of cool so far. I, I do like it more than Genshin Impact. I have a strange feeling that it's probably like a big thing of like Tower of Fantasy versus Genshin Impact. I like the combat, this traversal thing's pretty cool. But just so I don't get any hate, uh, Genshin Impact's like cool, I suppose. Um, but I'm not gonna hate on the game, of course, because every game has an audience and there's people that enjoy it for what it is. 
But this game I do like more, specifically because of the combat and the traversal. And I do also enjoy how everything so far has pretty much been voice acted. I like that in games. But that's pretty much about it, though. So I'm going to call it quits at that. And, uh, yeah, have a good one.